Welcome to Forex for a Living YouTube channel. Take note. The video you are about to watch is not financial advice. Do your own research before investing. In this video, Dow Jones rallies over 500 points as Fed signals confidence in two rate cuts despite growth concerns. The Dow Jones Industrial Average, DJIA, posted a strong rally on Wednesday, surging by as much as 540 points at its peak. Investor sentiment was buoyed by the Federal Reserve's reaffirmed outlook for two potential rate cuts later this year, helping equities regain their footing after recent volatility. The move came despite growing economic headwinds and policy uncertainty stemming from the Trump administration's erratic trade strategies. By the closing bell, the Dow Jones reclaimed the critical 42,000 level, while the S&P 500 rose approximately 1.5%, as market participants shifted back into risk-on mode following the Fed's policy decision. Investors welcomed the Fed's cautious optimism, interpreting it as a sign that monetary policy could remain supportive even in the face of softer growth forecasts. As expected, the Federal Reserve left interest rates unchanged at its latest meeting, maintaining its benchmark Fed funds rate in the 4.25% to 4.50% range. However, the focus quickly turned to updated economic projections, which reveal a downward revision in the Fed's 2025 GDP growth forecast to 1.7%, down from the 2.1% estimate issued in December. In his post-meeting remarks, Fed Chair Jerome Powell attributed much of the reduced outlook to ongoing trade policy uncertainties. Powell specifically pointed to the Trump administration's unpredictable use of tariffs, often announced via social media and subsequently reversed, as a key factor hampering business confidence and economic planning. This volatility has introduced a layer of uncertainty that's weighing on the economy's growth prospects, Powell remarked. Despite these concerns, Powell emphasized the resilience of the U.S. labor market and the underlying strength of the consumer sector, noting that these factors continue to provide a solid foundation for the broader economy. The Fed's dot plot showed policymakers maintaining their projection for two rate cuts by the end of 2025, with the median Fed funds rate expected to remain at 3.9%, unchanged from prior forecasts. Powell reiterated that the central bank would not be rushed into cutting rates, stating, we are not going to be in any hurry to move on rate cuts. We will proceed carefully, guided by incoming data. Markets are currently pricing in a 65% probability of a quarter-point rate cut at the Fed's June 18th meeting, with rate futures suggesting more easing could follow before year-end. Additionally, the Federal Open Market Committee, FOMC, plans to begin slowing the pace of its balance sheet runoff in April, a move seen as further evidence of a shift toward a more accommodative stance. The Fed's cautious tone aligns with Fed Street's Fed Sentiment Index, which tracks the policy leanings of individual Fed speakers. The index currently indicates a slightly dovish bias among policymakers, though Powell's comments suggest the Fed is taking a wait-and-see approach as it monitors evolving economic conditions. Even as equities rally, concerns remain about the broader economic outlook. The Trump administration's unpredictable approach to trade policy has reignited fears of stagflation, with the risk of both rising inflation and slowing growth. Analysts warn that renewed tariffs could place additional pressure on supply chains, driving up consumer prices while dampening corporate investment. Despite these risks, Powell maintained an upbeat tone, stating that the Fed's current policy stance well positioned to address both the risks and uncertainties we face. While growth projections have been lowered, Powell reassured markets that the Fed still expects at least two rate cuts before year-end, contingent on economic data.